Hello everyone, I hope you are doing well. Welcome to my channel. In this clip, we want to learn how we can use the uh, video capturing example of OpenCV in plugin in the Unity and uh, make it better, maybe. Okay, let's do this. Uh, first, you need to have OpenCV plugin for Unity and import it to your uh, project assets folder. And come here, examples, and in here, main modules. In here, the last folder is called video IO. And the third one is video writer example. So if you open the scene, you will see it has. Uh, an example which can uh, you can rotate your mod, uh, cube and if you press on record it start to recording uh, you need to know that uh, it just record the objects and the cameras view no UI and no mouse cursor and uh, it has been finished it is in here if you click on play yes it works and also if you go to this address users add uh, your username folder app data local uh, local low atr and it is the company name it is the project name and it is the final video in here at the format of it is avi but you need to know you need to see something cool in here you will see the label it's called the save path and the address of this video file and also this is the uh, the counter something it will be finished when it is equal 300 okay let's to find out how we can improve these options and use it in the game scenes or other project scenes let's to make a scene I want to save it in here and call it video capture perfect as you can see this scene has a main camera which has video writer example so if you open it and go to the visual studio it has an option for FPS counter, it's called max, uh, frame counter. Sorry, it is maximum frame counter equal 300. So it means uh, after 300 frames, our uh, capturing will be a stop. But it doesn't make any sense, honestly. So I prepare. I propose to make a little bit. Uh, bigger for example i don't know uh, 900 or 90,000 something yeah it is 90,000 frames but it is for automatic stop uh, you always have an option for uh, manually stop the recording so other thing is uh, if you don't want to add your uh, informations or your frame counter you can come here on post render and in here you can disable these options this is for frame counter in top right and this is for the save pass title and this is for the uh, correct path and the file name we don't need them so I disabled them okay let's come back to the unity right and once again we want to capture our video it's recording I want to rotate this cube okay and stop okay and now I play. Okay, it doesn't have any uh, UI elements, and also it's perfect. And come back here. You can see in this my folder. Okay, without any UI. Okay, but 
if I recording again and one second it's replaced with the previous one because the name of the videos are the same so I want to create a uh, system to generate automatically the names for our video files so they will not uh, replace on each other so we can come to this part in the on record on rec button click in here you can see uh, in a unity if it is unity uh, if it isn't unity ios or ios platform let's to make the name with this one and the uh, format is avi if it is ios let's to make it by mpm 4 v and the name by this one you can select any format in here by a purpose to keep it on avi for better quality but in here this is our video name video writer example output exactly here i want to add something cool okay i say system dot data time dot now dot to a string it's try to get the current date and current time and use them as a name of the file so I call it um, before that I call it a video clip okay now this one we need to make a format for our uh, naming and uh, time uh, date and time naming so I call it DD and MM and YYYY for the year this is day month year it is for date and also HH this for hour MM for minute and SS for seconds perfect now we can copy this part as well and paste here perfect okay now let's play the scene um, it has been compiled Yes, I suppose. Start the recording. Oh, maybe there is a problem. Uh, in here, it's fine. Let me to remove this guy. Okay. I found the problem. The problem was uh, I didn't add double quotation in here for the iOS name. So I added here and after save, as you can see it is fixed and perfect. Now let's recording. Okay, do something like this and stop. And this is our video with generated name perfect and a stop you can hear something like this and record another one and stop and now it's try to play the last one but in here we have both of them perfect okay so only thing uh, you need to do is 
you need to add this script and these buttons record and play and this input field into your uh, game scene and into your uh, main camera or that camera you want to uh, capture the video and use it on uh, in your project game simulators or other uh, products okay I hope this video will be useful for you and I want to invite you to subscribe my channel and uh, follow all the videos related to AR, VR, XR in Unity. And don't forget to like and make a comment for this video. Thank you.